What's up folks? I hope everyone's enjoying their May long weekend. Uh, welcome back to the channel. I've got a box of goodies from XS650 Direct. I'm going to get into them and see if I can apply them to my bike today. My side covers have been in rough shape for some time. Uh, as you can see, the, the latches are broken on both of them. I don't have rubber grommets to hold them onto the hangers. And this one, I hit a speed bump one day, it fell off and bounced down the road. So it's got scratches and mars all over it. Uh, good news is I got a little box of goodies from XS650 Direct. I should have some latches and grommets in there to solve this issue. Here's what I ordered. I got uh, two sets of latches, two sets of grommets. Uh, if you watched my last video, someone had stolen my uh, nuts and bolts from my uh, right side exhaust system. So now I have mismatched uh, nuts on my exhaust headers. So I got a new set of exhaust nuts and uh, lock washers. Uh, also two hanger bolts for the, uh, for the lower lower uh, section of the exhaust headers. Uh, I also got a new seal for the gas cap and that's a new negative uh, battery terminal or battery uh, cable. So let's see if we can get these side covers put together first. I ran into a problem right away with the hanger grommets. Uh, as you can see, they come wider or these ones did anyway they're probably for a different model Let's see if i can get you a visual there way too long for the holes so what i ended up doing what i ended up doing was just notching out the corners see i just pulled pulled a couple of notches out of the top corners of uh of this one so now this so now i've got it fitting flush and it uh, should do the job i wish they were the right size but uh gotta deal with the deal with the issue using what i have i notched out all four grommets to make them fit those should hang a lot quieter now. Uh, I'm going to move on to the latches next. So for this other round grommet, you got to pull the center steel uh, guide out and then push the rubber through and put the steel guide back in. There we go, I got that pin out. You gotta take the pin out of the, take the pin out of the uh, pin, what? I don't know, fuck. That grommet doesn't look too bad, but I think we're still gonna get it out of there. So there's the new one. center piece there it is mm 
<laughs> there we go. Snug. Snug. Okay, I got these latches put back together. This one's too tight. When I put this one back together, I cut a piece of the spring off so that it would fit in the catch on the bike. This one, I still have to pull apart one more time, take a piece of this spring out because there's just no room. There's no room to compress this for it to catch on the catch on the bike. So I'm going to disassemble this, remove a piece of the spring. So I'm going to cut a chunk of this spring off. I'm going to straighten it out a bit here so we can gain it. spring so we'll grab that bring that in just a little bit there we go now I'll put that cut end against the stay at the bottom this goes through here we'll grab a washer washer goes over that bit and we need this goddamn pin again pin again There it is. Hanger grommets, latch grommets, new latch. Let's see if they fit on the bike. No more rattles. Nice and tight. Had to modify the springs a little bit to get them to work. Same with the grommets, the hanger grommets up top, there and there. Well, I was hoping those grommets and latches would fit a lot better than they did. I don't know if they're for a different year. Maybe they're for an earlier model or what. They didn't specify on the uh, XS650 Direct page. A uh, little bit of modification and I got them to work. No more rattling on those side covers. That excites me. I'm glad they won't fall off when I hit speed bumps anymore. Uh, that's about all I'm going to do for today. Uh, next video, I will probably do those uh, exhaust nuts and hangers, as well as the uh, fuel fuel tank rubber seal in the uh, fuel cap, as well as the negative battery cable. So, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed what you saw, maybe uh, subscribe. Like, share, comment. Uh, I appreciate you. Thanks for stopping by. I'll try and get the next video out soon. Cheers. Thanks.